Walking around Cal State Fullerton's College of the Arts, one notices many different and unique art pieces scattering the grounds. But in the Begovich Gallery, people can view the evidence of a forgotten practice, presenting Beyond the Dark Veil. Beyond the Dark Veil is about post-mortem and morning photography from the Thanatos archive. And the photographs that you see in the exhibition are mainly from the Victorian era, um, from, primarily from the 1840s to the 1880s. And we have um, the exhibition broken into six different sections. Um, we have a section on um, pre-mortem and deathbed photographs, um, a section on crime, murder, and tragedy, um, a section on pets and beloved animals, um, we have a morning and ephemera section that also has some sculptural pieces. And we also have a large section on family and children, babies, and then adults. With a darker subject matter such as this, people might wonder why this method was practiced in the first place. Um, after the invention of the daguerreotype in 1839 by Louis Daguerre in France, um, photography um, becomes extremely popular and Photography studios pop up um, primarily um, more in the 1850s and 1860s, and the height of post-mortem photography um, is in the 1860s and 1870s. These photos are displayed with photos of the living in parlors and in family rooms, so they're not something that's hidden away. It's something that's really cherished as a remembrance of um, a loved one who's passed, of a family member who's passed. As well as photography, the exhibition displays a wide array of post-mortem artwork. We also have a really beautiful um, white weeper sculpture, and we have a beautiful Victorian bird sarcophagus from 1874 that still has the original bluebird taxidermy inside. And we also have um, a marble base that has a set of original baby shoes. Um, it's a baby shoe memorial. Um, in the section of the cemetery and ephemeral objects. For more information on Beyond the Dark Veil or Cal State Fullerton Arts, please visit www.fullerton.edu backslash arts. For Titan TV, I'm Chris Erbstoser.